Family members of a Taiwanese tourist kidnapped last month while vacationing in East Malaysia are not giving details into how the victim's release was finally secured. It is rumored that around 8 million Taiwan dollars were paid in ransom money to secure the release of Zhang Anwei. But for now, the family is simply happy to have Zhang back home. This is John Da Gong, the brother of kidnapping victim John Anwei, holding a photo taken by his sister's captors. For more than a month, he sought her release. His only regret was that there was no such happy ending for his sister's partner, Xu Li Min, who was killed when John was taken hostage. As soon as she departed the plane, she wanted to visit Xu Li Min's funerary shrine, says Zhang. But I told her not to because of all the commotion with the reporters there. After 36 days in captivity, John Anwei traveled to Manila on Friday under the protection of Philippine soldiers. Yesterday, she returned to Taiwan. She didn't say much, but looked good. Her brother offered some insight into the methods used for John to regain her freedom. Apart from the leader, their English wasn't very good, says John. We also were able to use Chinese as a secret code. For example, she would tell me whether she was by the sea or in the mountains. And they didn't mistreat her. When she wanted coconut to eat, they climbed a tree to get it. The Zhang family negotiated with the kidnappers. It wouldn't say whether force used by the Philippines military, as claimed by the government there, or ransom money is what finally was able to secure John's release.